what is up guys, Trex here, and welcome to The Escapist. This is the prisons, uh, prison architect simulator game where you're not actually building the prison, but instead trying to escape from it. Brought to you by Team17, who actually created the Worms games. Uh, if you would excuse me, I am a bit sick, so I may sound a bit different and congested in this Let's Play. So here are the characters. We have Rabbit, Bald Eagle, Lifer, that's racist, Young Buck, Old Timer, Billy Goat, Frosif, it's also racist, Tingo, and Maru, which I think is racist. So obviously we are going to be Billy Goat because he has blue hair, and we're going to name him Bilbo Baggins because HOBBITS! And here we are, dear Bilbo Baggins, welcome to Center Perks, the most comfortable, low security prison in the country. On behalf of all the staff here, we wish you a happy and relaxing visit. Should you get bored of the complimentary cable TV, we pride ourselves in many other engaging activities around the grounds. Man, it really sounds like they want me to escape. So some of these guys have little yellow money bags above their heads. That means they have stuff to sell you. So if you look in their inventory, this guy, Micah, has a stepladder, a bottle of medicine, a jar of ink, and a flashlight. Seeing as I only have $10, I will purchase none of these things. This guy over here with the green exc exclamation mark above his head means that he has a quest for you. So if you just ask him what he wants. Hunter, I'm on the lookout for a silk handkerchief. Could you get me one? So these quests are a good way to get money. Uh, and once you complete the quest, you just have to give it to the guy, and your pay will go up, and your reputation with that prisoner will go up. Ooh, doctor, can I, uh, doctor, doctor, where are you going? Can I come with you? I want to go with you. I think that, yeah, the doctor goes in here. I wonder if I can get, get, dang, dang it, I can't. You're patient with patience. Well, that's nice. Ah, uh, the stereotypical lunch drama. There's people sitting at this table, and one guy sitting by himself. Hello, friend. How are you? I killed a man. Okay, so sometimes you have these free periods throughout the day which you can use to go and either level up your stats. Uh, when you start off, you have uh, low strength, speed, and intellect, but throughout the day, you, uh, throughout your time at this prison, you will be able to build that up, and you will need to build that up so that you can escape the prison and overpower guards, and that's something very useful. So intellect you just get from browsing the internet. You'd think that'd work in reverse. So, many... Cat pictures. So many Reddit posts. Somehow sitting at a computer and browsing the internet increases your fatigue, which is indicated by this little yellow meter, as you can see. Fatigue. So after this, you generally have to go and take a, a nice shower or eat some food. Man, you could just eat the food while browsing the internet, couldn't you? It appears that in this cutlery box, they're giving you all the things you need to escape. A spoon to dig and a knife as a weapon. I'm just gonna take this for, uh, reasons. You saw nothing, Officer Chris. So, along the way, I got two quests to beat up the same person. So I might as well just kill one bird with one stone and get two chores done? Is that how that works? Uh, so now you have jobs. I th believe that the job is different at every prison. Uh, but also, you can sabotage prisoners on their way to jobs so that they will get fired and you your job will open up. So my job is the laundry, so all we have to do is just get the dirty laundry and stand in between the wa washing machines, take out the dirty laundry, put more dirty laundry into the washing machine, take that laundry out, and put it back in. Gosh, it seems like you just hire someone for this. Oh wait, that's me. This guy's name is Super Cool, and if that's not super cool to you, then I don't know what is. Ah, Hunter, you are my target, so I'm just gonna- Oh, come on, really? Really? It's knocked out. Uh, yep, lost my knife, and dang it. So that didn't work, and okay, you're gonna still have my quests. So apparently I got ganged up on, which I didn't know could happen in this game. Well, one of us is gonna have to change. Ah, the exercise period. One of the, my favorite parts of the day, you just get these little exercise mini games where you have to- mash keys as fast as possible to build up your strength and speed and once you do that you can just assault a guard and eventually escape prison. That's what the point of these are, right? Ooh, this guy is selling a crafting note. Crafting notes are useful because you can use them to gain recipes. So I can create a cell key mold now, but that requires intellect and these guys are beating up each other. Oh, so now I can uh, just search him for uh, ooh. Looks like we've got shaving cream and a DVD. Oh, okay, okay. No, I. Oh, oh gosh, why is he chasing me? I, I just wanted the shaving cream, sir. 
Can I use the shaving cream? Apparently not. All right, Hunter. You, me, one bathroom stall. Let's do this. Let's go, go, go. Dang it! Come on, really? Ooh, just a random dead body. Uh, nails and clothes. I'll steal the clothes and take the nails as well. Thank you. Do 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 Hello there, missing something? Oh, really? You? How did you get another pair of clothes? Come on. So I just found in Super Cool's desk a file, which is good because we can use the file to try and style this vent cover. Oh gosh, guard! Hello there, sir. Thank you for just ignoring me. So hopefully this file won't get too damaged before this vent comes out. Oh gosh, hello there, Officer Steve. Okay, come on, hurry up, hurry up. File, 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 file. Can we get through this vent before another guard passes along? Uh, it has 30% left, and the vent has 52% left. We might need to buy another file because, oh no, but it's still alive, still alive. And it just got used up. Dang it, the file breaks. It's just like a text-based RPG. Let's just put this back and act like nothing ever happened. Oh gosh, fight, 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 keys, keys, keys. Uh, could you guys just thank you, Micah. Stealing your clothes again, Micah. No clothes for you. But, Sprit saying you can have the clothes. <sighs> Alright, Hunter, let's do this. I have a bounty on your back. What do you have? Why did I get a bed sheet? Okay, uh, don't ask questions, just fight Hunter. And ignore the guard. Come on, we can do this. Gosh! Dang it! Hunter! wonder why my toilet bowl doesn't have water in it, yet these other two do. I'm not gonna question that. This prison group is about as diverse as a stereotypical teen movie these days. Except that we have three people with blue hair and two old guys. Free period. Where is Hunter? I've got a bone to pick with him. It's funny how nails are legal, but dirt is considered an illegal contraband. Oh, prison. Ah, a file, sweet. We can continue our work for our escape. So we just set down our desk right here, get on top of it. Vent is still at 28%. That is always good. 20%. Ooh, we might actually be able to escape. 12%. To 4%. Okay, here we go. Uh, yeah, put the desk down. And climb up. Okay, we are in the vent system now. We can't cross over there. Well... Dang it. So anyways guys, that was The Escapist, the uh, prison architect simulator where you are the prisoner and you don't get to build the prison, so it's nothing really like prison architect. But anyways, I got put in solitary, lost all my stuff, and I wasn't able to escape. So thank you all very, very much for watching. Go buy this fantastic game on Steam. I'm gonna get you, Hunter. And I will see you all next time. So if you liked the video, then be sure to like the video and subscribe to my channel for some more awesome content. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye. Dang it, Hunter!